When you get to the screen, just close it. Save your file. This way, After Effects doesn't save the imported images and other files into a temporary space. So just save as, call this my bounce animation. Click on save. This could be a similar process between After Effects, Premiere, and Final Cut Pro, and iMovie, and everything else, most likely. Most likely. Little asterisk there. Go under File, Import. In After Effects, I'm selecting a single file. In Premiere, it would be a single file too because there's an option to pull in a sequence of images. So File, Import, File. Go into my Bounce folder. I'm clicking on this image. And make sure you click on PNG Sequence. It might be called File Sequence in a different application. Look for the word Sequence. Click on Import. In After Effects, all I have to do is drag this out to this icon to make a new composition. Drag into new composition. And then all I have to do is press the space bar in After Effects to play it. To save this as a movie, to export it from After Effects, go under File, Export, Add to Media Encoder. Wait for the file to show up. H264, that's the format. Match high bitrate, where to save it, and I'll click on save. Then click this green arrow right here, and your animation's done. I'll click this link. That opens the folder location with the file. And there's the animation. Let me show you the process for Adobe Premiere. And create a new project. I'm going to call it Temp Animation. Pick a location for your project and click OK. Off in this project area right here, right click, import, select the first frame in the sequence, and check. A lot of video applications have this image sequence part, so look for it in your own video application. Now that this is checked, click on Open. To render this out, click on this asset and drag it to this icon. If you don't see that icon, just expand this window. See how it's hidden? You can drag that window open, drag it, and drop it here. This puts it on a timeline. You can preview this timeline by pressing the space bar. To render out, file, export, media. You can export right from here or send it to Media Encoder by clicking this button. Select, and if you don't want Media Encoder, just click Export. And that creates from the images an MP4 file through Premiere.